Hey guys, it's Teresa. Today I'm going to show you how to achieve this natural, everyday work makeup look. The products that I'm going to be using today are NYX Illuminator, NYX Day Matte but Not Flat Foundation, Max Nymphet Lip Gloss, my mixture of MAC Studio Finish Concealer, MAC Studio Fix Press Powder, MAC Studio Finish Concealer in NC42, NYX Girl Talk, Maybelline Falsies Mascara, NYX Mobbing Out, some eyelash curlers, Max Razzle Dazzler Lipstick, Max Espresso Eyeshadow, and Max Fix Plus. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. So first, I'm going to take my foundation and I'm just going to dab that on my face and I'm just going to blend it in with my fingers. And I like applying my foundation with my fingers in the morning because it's quick and it's easy and I don't need any additional tools to apply my foundation. So I'm going to really quickly brush my eyebrows up so I can prepare for my eyebrows. But first, I'm going to conceal my vitiligo spot a little bit more. So with my concealer mixture from MAC, I'm just going to take that, dab it on there. And then I'm just going to buff out the harsh lines that I have around the edges of my spot. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and take Max Espresso and I'm going to take my Fix Plus and I'm just going to spray a little bit in there real quick. And then with my angle brush, I am going to go in there, grab some product and start doing my brows. Okay, so I'm going to start applying this product in little short strokes and I don't start all the way at the beginning of my brow I just leave a little bit of space there so that I can have a more natural looking brow right there and I love using the fix plus or even water with this espresso because it darkens the product and it goes on more smoothly so it's not like a powder to where when I put it on, it just goes everywhere. It makes my eyebrows more defined. And to me, it's just a more precise method for applying my brows. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and do the other brow. I need to get a little bit more Fix Plus. And I'm gonna go ahead and start that brow. And as I was watching this video, I noticed that the brow that we see on our left, like the arch just looks so crazy. And so I was just like, oh my gosh, like fill in that brow, fill in that brow. <laughs> and then I finally did. I was like, yes, I was waiting on it. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take my concealer from MAC and with this small flat brush, I'm going to conceal my brows because I know that I sometimes form a shape with my brows that looks kind of crazy. So I definitely need to clean that up.
right, now that I have those concealed, I'm gonna go in with Studio Fix from MAC, and I'm going to just go ahead and set that concealer that I put on my chin for that vitiligo, and I'm also going to set my eyelids and under my brow. And I'm doing it this way because I don't plan on adding any eyeshadow today. I'm going for a very natural look, but I know that I still need to set my concealer. Now I'm going to take Mauve and Out by NYX and I'm going to take this fluffy foundation brush and apply this to my cheeks. I'm also going to take this color up my temples, around my forehead, and under my chin as well, just so that I can warm my face up a little bit. Now taking NYX Illuminator, along with this fluffy brush right here, I am going to highlight my cheekbones, and my nose, and my chin. I also decided to be a little extra here and highlight above my brows. I don't normally do that, but I was just feeling it. Now I'm going to go in with NYX Girl Talk and I'm going to take this little pencil brush and highlight the inner corner of my eye. So I'm just going to take a little bit of product and just kind of pack it on there. And sometimes I get a little crazy with this, but I just love this. I just love it so much. <laughs> and as I added in one of my previous videos, I do this because it draws attention to your eyes and it also makes them seem brighter. See, I just can't stop. I just keep going. And I'm just feeling it right there like, yes. Now I'm going to take my eyelash curlers and I'm going to curl my lashes. So I'm just going to put this at the base of my lash line and I'm just going to pump it a little bit and hold it on there for about 10 seconds on each eye. Ooh, look at that curl. You can't even really see it, but you kind of can from that little angle right there. You see that curl? Going in with my Maybelline Falsies, which I love, I am just going to apply a coat or two of mascara to my lashes. Now I'm trying to go real fast because I'm trying to get ready for work and I'm like oh crap look at that but I was like it's all right I got this I got this later I'm gonna fix it okay so now I'm gonna go in with my trusty q-tip and since it dried I'm gonna go ahead and just wipe that away really easily boom it's gone Going in with Max Razzle Dazzler, I'm going to go ahead and apply this to my lips so that I can give my lips a little nude, peachy hue. Alright, now I'm going to take Max and Infect and I'm just going to apply a coat of this over my lips because I love the shine that it gives me. Okay, boom, so that is it. That is the final look and I am ready to go to work.